All right. In your health tonight, there's new technology out there to help you shed the pounds, and it does not involve surgery. That's right. Basically, doctors are able to implant this weight loss tool. No surgery required. Mm -hmm. News 8's medical reporter Jocelyn Mementa is here to tell us more about what doctors at Hartford Hospital are offering there. Jocelyn. There's a lot of buzz about this one. It's approved for patients who are 30 to 100 pounds overweight, those who typically are not able to undergo a bariatric or surgical procedure. This is the latest tool in the battle against the bulge. It's a balloon made of silicone. The plate's about the size of a grapefruit. Filled with saline solution. Well, this is going to sit in the stomach and move around the stomach. Dr. Darren Tischler is the medical director of the Surgical Weight Loss Center at Hartford Hospital. The Abira is really the first new implantable technology for a weight loss that doesn't involve any surgery. It is placed into the stomach from the mouth where it is inflated so that patients feel more satisfied with less food. The biggest problem that people have trying to lose weight is that they feel hungry and if we can help control hunger and allow someone to feel full and satisfied if, after eating a very small reasonably sized meal they're going to do much better. Dr. Tischler says on average expect to lose around 40 percent of the extra pounds. So even um, 30, 40, 50 pounds of weight loss will help improve medical problems like diabetes, high blood pressure, high cholesterol. But the balloon is only temporary. Doctors remove it after six months. So the balloon really helps with controlling hunger but the rest of the program is what helps people change their lifestyle so that after the balloon is removed they can keep the weight off in the long run. The program includes registered dietitian Katrina Minsky among the team of experts keeping people on the right track. Once the balloon is removed we hope that you've um, modified your lifestyle, um, that you've learned proper size portions, uh, that you incorporated some sort of activity into your day-to-day -day routine. Smaller portions of a balanced diet of lean proteins, veggies, fruits, and whole grain carbs are key. And I say all foods can fit. Um, or bear is not going to stop you from eating certain foods, but certain foods can help you feel more full. There is a small risk for complications, including nausea, vomiting, and the risk of the balloon deflating. Now, the cost is close to $9,000. It is not yet covered by insurance. There is a free class offered later this month. Head to our website, WTNH.com, for more information. And